Hey guys, so this is just a game showcase that I'm doing of this game called Void. Um, basically, it just rack up quite a lot of publicity over the past few weeks after winning the independent game festival or something um, in China and yeah, and just showing some local love as well, created by students from DigiPen Singapore, the country I'm from as well, and so. Yeah, it's basically a first person first person view kind of puzzle game um that uses quite a quite a unique concept of um time traveling you can say maybe like um viewing the past and present and stuff like that. So yeah, I just want to show you guys this game and basically also testing out my setup for recording commentary and I'm doing basically doing also the how-to guide for recording live commentary for with using the the hub hub closes. So yeah, let's begin. Anyway, I've started already and I have um I've gone past some of the tutorial parts. So I'm like I don't know where I'm in, in the game. But anyways, yeah. So as you can see here, um this game uses the source engine. Right, you can create this um like time wraps or something that um will bring you to the past. As you can see. And we have this uh these glasses that would will show you how it looks like in the past and so now we are in the present. This glasses shows you what is in the past. So yeah, and we see like, for example, this table, um, something happened in this place. So yeah, um, what happened in the past was that it's perfectly fine. Yeah, anyway, pardon me, I'm doing my first um, live commentary. It's my first commentary in any ways. So yeah. So you just go ahead. Oh. We see so basically each level is like a puzzle that you have to solve using whatever you have. Okay. So let's say if we want to get across to the other side, you can see at first the floor is perfectly fine. So you just create a portal. Not really a portal, just a time dimension thing. Okay, so this is another tutorial tip. Wait, what? Hold on a moment. Yeah, alright. There we go. So basically, you have the ability to, um, like suck these objects up as well. So yeah, and you can place them wherever you see fit. So you can repair this. Right. So I guess here is where I put the plant. Oh. So this would probably destroy. Yeah. Right. As as you can see is quite a unique concept that we have here. And there we go. 
down to the series. Ouch. Um, so on go, further down. Apparently this is a rather short game anyway. It's not the full game per se. Oh crap. Oh shit. Okay, that wasn't intended. Prepare myself for this. Let's go. Oh man! I thought I had it, man. Let's try again. Alright, this should do it. Come on. Alright. Soften, so there's supposedly water in the past. Yep, so I'll just jump in. Oh, what? Okay. Um. Whoop. Here we go. This is pretty cool. Up we go. Can we pick up the plant? Apparently not. So we are now in the sewer, so yeah, I guess we have to go up again. Oh man. Okay, here we go. What? I need to find a switch. Up we go. Oh, this is the max. Oh, yeah. How silly of me. So anyway, yeah, as I said, as I mentioned earlier, you can download this off the DigiPen website. You do need the Source uh, Standard Development Kit installed in your system. Right, you can see some bookshelves there. Oh, nope, not good. So these objects will help you in solving the puzzle. These portraits are like collectibles of some sort. Crap. 
No, no, no. Con Ok. Oh, shish. Stuck it. There we go. This should work. There we go. So, yeah, I've collected the past few stuff. Portraits. So I guess where to next? I guess over there. Whoops. Whoops. Find key or something. There we are. So this game have this game has quite a lot of potential, really. That's what I believe anyway. Oh man, I thought I had it. Oof. So again, that's the end of the game. So yeah, it's a pretty nice concept actually. So if you can try it out, you can go to the Japan or maybe I'll just put some of the links below for you. So yeah, there you have it, Void by DigiPen Singapore, students made it for their final year exam or something like that. Winner of the best concept or something like that on IG, IGF China. So yeah, there we go. If you have any comments on the commentary itself, as in not the content, but rather the quality, um, do let me know. Obviously, in content-wise, um, I'm not that adequate in comment commentering, I guess. Commentating, rather. <laughs> Sorry. So, there we go. Void.